Why is there a hungry piranha tank in my laundry room? I don't know if that's a question that I want answered, to be perfectly honest. Ooh, sunglasses. Hey, you! Oh! 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 Wait! No! What did- uh, Oh, it's a sheep! Are you kidding me right now? Stan, are you okay? <laughs> Why is there a sheep in the laundry room? Are they in cahoots with the fridge crab? These are the questions that make the nurses here think that I'm losing my damn mind, when in all reality, I'm losing my body! What's up, guys? Welcome back to Just Die Already, that game that can really only be described as a geriatric mayhem simulator. Now, some of you may remember that we're getting kicked out of this lovely retirement home when like, they couldn't have picked a worse possible person to do that to. Because we're old, we're angry, we're deathly allergic to penicillin, bee stings, and red-colored carpets. On second thought, maybe we should get out of this place. No elderly gentleman should be left unattended long enough to bay blade on his nips until he passes out. You see, this place had the big-brained idea of replacing most of the nurses with bars on the windows, and boards on the doors, and locks on the gates. Which kind of sends a mixed signal? Like, did they want me to leave or not? I could have swore I was getting evicted. They think they can lock me up in here with these flimsy planks? If only I had a sharp object, I could break them. I like how you just broke your neck, Stanislav. Are you okay? Is there a reason you're trying to split the boards using your cock? It's weird, especially considering your cock is over here. I mean, we can try to grab it, but... Yeah, it doesn't really work. You know, in your old age, you can't be swinging that thing around. Oh, yes, it's true what the poster says. You never forget your first lick of an Ahiago Ice Queen. <laughs> That'll get your rooster revving. But where are we going to find a sharp object in a retirement home? They do a pretty good job of making sure we don't have access to any of those things. <laughs> we can, uh... Have our arm snap off when trying to open the refrigerator. You see, everything is a friggin' danger in here. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I guess that's kind of sharp. We could go for round two against the fridge, but it would be our last chance. <laughs> so how about we try a little something like this first? Yeah, there you go. Stan's actually right-handed, so hopefully he'll be able to finagle things. No? Not sharp enough? Can we use the other end? I'm genuinely starting to think that this refrigerator is haunted. We didn't just lose an arm by accident, okay? It was a warning. Because now, every time I get close to it, I, I don't even have to do anything. It just kind of tears me apart. Like, what did I do to deserve that? <laughs> We're gonna have a real hard time doing just about anything if you're walking around looking like a chicken nugget. Careful, careful, and we're in! It was you! You're the one who's been snipping me apart this entire time! No, 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 I don't think so, smart guy. So I need to find a way to kill him and take his claws to get me out of here. But what would I use to kill a crab? Oh, thankfully! Uh, well, I'm... Sorry, what? Do the bananas grant him potassium and telekinesis? I was gonna say, at least one of the residents decided to bring their armed bear trap. That'd probably do a number on you. It shouldn't do anything to me now, considering I don't even have legs. I can- Ow! Oh, oh, that's not what I wanted at all. <laughs> Why can't anything go my way? You know what? Screw it. We're just gonna sacrifice ourselves to the crab and move on. Yeah, there, just finish the job. Thank you. Hello, Molotov cocktail. Don't mind if I do. We even found a backup plan. If the fridge crab keeps getting the best of us, then we could always try tucking and rolling out the crack in the window and off the balcony. I mean, what's the worst that could happen at this point, honestly? But hopefully I can get my fiery... Revenge? Please tell me that hit him. Can we get it close enough? 
He's not really writhing in pain, which isn't what I was looking for. Oh, oh, okay, okay, yep, the fire hurts. The fire definitely still hurts. Please tell me I at least cooked you. I didn't. Why does everything suck? All right, then screw it. Operation Tuck and Roll is in full effect. Okay, well, we got the roll, but we just... Actually, no, we've got the tuck. We, we, we need more roll. You gotta get out there, Stan. Come on. What's with all the bones? Suddenly you're the most flexible man alive, but you just can't squeeze all your body through there. Maybe we don't need all of our body. Yeah, it's no surprise you're eager to help with this idea. Just take the legs, okay? What did I say? Just the legs! Do you not understand English? I, I need everything else to be able to move around! Great, I'm butt cheeks again. I'm so tired of being reduced to butt cheeks by a crustacean. This might work, though. We might be able to hop our way up into the window there and... Oh, it's got a screen. I can, I can very finely see the screen in front. God damn it. Stan, I don't suppose that archaic pea-sized brain between the letters Q and E has any other ideas. <laughs> Maybe some options? I should be able to unlock this door with a golden key. There should be one around here somewhere. A golden key, huh? Alright, it's probably right next to the sharp object that we need for the other door. <laughs> Why was a golden key? I would probably be inside of a drawer. You've got to be kidding me. I've been able to do this the entire time? There's no way. This can't possibly be an exit, can it? Uh, no. Looks like it's a laundry room. Uh, anything sharp in here? Marco! Why is there a hungry piranha tank in my laundry room? I don't know if that's a question that I want answered, to be perfectly honest. Ooh, sunglasses. Hey, you! Oh! 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 Wait! No! What did- uh, Oh, it's a sheep. Are you kidding me right now? Stan, are you okay? <laughs> Why is there a sheep in the laundry room? Are they in cahoots with the fridge crab? These are the questions that make the nurses here think that I'm losing my damn mind, when in all reality, I'm losing my body! I think it's pretty safe to say that Stan isn't okay right now. I, I can't move all that much. The butt cheeks don't have enough lift to get out of the deep end. Oh, oh, there we go. Don't send me back in. Don't you dare do it. We're cool now, right? Oh, we're not. All right, then. So... Steer clear of all animals in the retirement home. It's just a, a general rule of thumb. You know, I'm here to live out the rest of my days, not a petting zoo. I'm gonna tell you what I told my wife for 32 years. Stay the hell away from my ass. <laughs> not interested. I'm kind of hoping that I can get lucky twice. If I need a sharp object, then maybe like the key. It would also be in a drawer. Oh, oh, there's dynamite in the drawer. Dynamite boy work if we could just uh, throw. Good throw, Stan! Really? It, it didn't take care of the boards? It definitely took out a piece of Stan? <laughs> All right, bud, let's check the damage. Oh, it's just an arm. No, we'll, we'll be perfectly fine. We could keep on trucking through that, right? Listen, Windows, if I wanted you to give a summary of the video up until this point, I would have asked. Oh, God, Stan, where did your clothes go and your nipples? <laughs> did you put them in the laundry? Because these machines are empty. Maybe there's like a hamper around here somewhere? That's a very old-timey laundry hamper. Oh, you know what? Screw the clothes. We got ourselves a sharp object, finally! We're as free as a bird, and our bird is free. <laughs> nice. Fish can't breathe out of water. Don't touch. XOXO, the management. Why didn't all of the other animals get a sign like that for me? Is it just me, or does this puddle look really dangerous? <laughs> oh, hey, Gladys. But well, it's a good thing I managed to put on my slacks. Otherwise, you would have done a triple front flip right into my ball sack. I think we're just going to avoid all that nonsense. Not interested. I'm only wearing one shoe. The sock doesn't have a whole lot of 
grip. Hello, nurse. <laughs> but you're surprised to see me. How did you get down here? I thought you were locked upstairs. I mean, taking a nap. Ah, uh, no matter. We're having a party for Joe, who just passed away. Well, good for Joe, one of the lucky ones. <laughs> Don't you dare destroy this party by going around hurting the others, opening presents, destroying balloons, or whatever other things you could do to ruin our good time. <laughs> Got it. I couldn't help but notice of the laundry list of things you just said, there was no don't hit on the nurse. So I don't suppose I could interest you in a cream pie, could I? <laughs> Come on, we can head it up stairs. Ow! Okay, well, I uh, definitely felt that one. If anybody at this party needs me, I'll just be lying down on the floor eating pie. <laughs> Which is being regenerated? Wait, well, did I die and go to heaven? Ooh, oh, okay, yeah, I'll take it. What's the over-under on me dying of a heart attack? Before I get out of here. Not quite what I meant, but... <laughs> yeah, that works. Wait, I'm alive. I, I'm so There we go. Okay, no, I can still have more pie. I can have seconds. I'm good. Oh, I think these two are really upset that they lost Joe. <laughs> now I feel bad for eating all that pie and exploding on their cake. Can I maybe comfort you somehow? Or grab hold of you by the anus and drag you around into the fire? <laughs> that, that, that is not what I intended! I know I said that I could do that, but I didn't think I could do that! I'm sorry! <laughs> Mistakes were made! I, I didn't I didn't do that. No, stop getting mad at me. I'm not the one spreading the fire. Okay, maybe I spread that a little bit. I'm trying to put it out. I swear. <laughs> okay, there, there. I'm still alive. Everyone's still alive. You're still alive? Yeah, you're good. You're giving me the thumbs down. How about a slap roll time? There we go. She slapped me so hard, my hip came out my ass. I might need a little bit of medication for that. I don't think she'll mind. There are no crabs in here, right? I should be safe. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, put the bones back inside. <laughs> oh, oh, I, I completely forgot that the medication Willy Wonka's you. <laughs> I knew that. I already knew that. I've played this game before. Damn it. She talks big, but what do I have to do to get kicked out of this place? Honestly, now. What if I dance in front of you? Does that piss you off at all? Oh yeah, you're gonna flip me the bird, but you're not gonna kick me out. I, 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 I don't get it. I'm gonna go get my axe. Screw it. See how eager she is to let me stay after I've turned everybody into cooked chickens? Sure, that works for me. Oh, he didn't turn into cooked chickens. He just turned into goo. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> how about these presents? Can I, can I get to them? Come on, I gotta be able to get up and get to them. Just uh, uh, oh, I can I can open them. Yeah, we'll open. Oh, bees! What? Why is there bees? You'll throw me out, will you? Good luck. You're gonna need a broom and a mop. <laughs> Who gifted Joe a hive of bees? Oh my God! Look at her. Uh, she had it coming. Good luck kicking me out when you're suffering from anaphylactic shock. No, no, no. I'm good. I'm still fine. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Maybe I could, uh, oh, no, I, I tried to dance, but uh, I, I might need a brain for that. <laughs> I could do a little dance like this. <laughs> oh, no, wait, how did you two come back to life? I thought only I could do that. Is, is Joe going to show up to this party? I think the last thing I have to do is destroy the balloons, but it, it's kind of difficult without arms. <laughs> I'm not sure what I should do. I mean, other than, you know, something like that. You can chop up the guests and eat all the food to make yourself explode. And you can even release the gift bees. But you know what? We draw the line at blowing up the balloons. <laughs> Isn't that right, nurse? Oh. That's gonna piss her off. Oh, wait, did it work? I just started dancing in front of her, and she threw me out on my head. Did you really need to go for the head? Do you have any idea how bad Road Rash looks on a bald scalp? 
<laughs> Come on now. Hey, you there! Uh, yeah? Come here for a second. Do I have to? I really don't want to talk to the smelly hobo that lives between the dumpster and the outhouse. <laughs> you picked some prime real estate, my guy. What can I do for you other than jump in your son? Finally thrown out of that stinky retirement home, eh? You've been in there, have you? Well, that's Grace. Welcome to the outside world, my friend. From here, it can only get better. I, I figured that much. It can't get much worse. <laughs> there are tons of things you can do, but most elderly work on life goals in their bucket list. Well, I've got like objectives now. It's not just aimless fun anymore. Completing life goals in your bucket list can reward you with new items that you can buy in vending machines. All right, I'm picking up what you're putting down. Some life goals reward a special item, tickets. Tickets can be used to buy special items from the blue vending machine. You can also find these tickets around the city. Feel free to take them. You can use tickets to buy the new retirement plan. It is the dream of every elderly. I heard they ship you off to a retirement home in Florida. Oh, you don't have a bucket list? Here, you can have mine. I'm never getting to Florida anyway. Well, thank you, strange poop man. I appreciate that. So that's the end game. I want to... Well, first, figure out why this car is parked on the divider and, and then get my true retirement to a home that doesn't suck. <laughs> I like it. All right, you know what? I think that's going to be it for this episode of Just Die Already, guys. I really did miss this game. I loved playing the demo. I'm happy that we're out into the open world now and that there's going to be so much to do. So if you guys want to see more, if you want to see this become a series, then as always, be sure to leave a like in the video, leave a comment letting me know, and maybe I'll return to find out what the hell is that? Is that a person? I think that's a person with a balloon. Uh, these are questions left for another episode. <laughs> but thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.